everybody, I'm Kit Kiavie and today I'm going to be making a pasta salad. So in my sufuria, I have fusilli. This is the squiggly one. So I have fusilli and it's raw, about 200 grams. I'm going to pour some hot water in this. I always, always put oil first and then some salt and then the hot water like so so this is going to boil for about 10 minutes which is more than enough time to cut up my vegetables this is the it's a really really easy salad like if you have guests suddenly or you just feel like something light for lunch i know pasta many people don't consider it light but it is what it is <laughs> so what i'm going to do is chop up my vegetables and just make sure that everything is ready so when the pasta comes out i will drain it and then mix everything together and literally bob's your uncle lunch um yeah so i have some tuna i have a whole can of tuna there i always buy the one that is in brine not the one that is in oil and then sweet corn so you can either buy this fresh or you can buy it um, in a can, it's up to you. Some mayonnaise, um, two tablespoons, not a lot, half an onion, a whole tomato, some cucumber and some lettuce. Dice everything the same size so that in one bite you're able to get a little bit of everything. My onion is ready. Too much of time. Okay, so many people ask me if I genuinely like salad or I do it for weight loss or whatever. Literally, listen. Salad is the yummiest thing. You know people try to eat boring, bland vegetables. People eat boring, bland vegetables, no seasoning, no salt, no olive oil, no like vinegar, apple cider vinegar, delicious yummy things lemon and then you say salads are bad no they're not you're just eating the wrong ones <laughs> salads are delicious i love salad i don't anyway if you are a boring salad eater don't say salad is bad go on the internet look for interesting salad recipes and try them out okay these are things that you can find anywhere please even a mamamboga will definitely have lettuce and cucumber and then try different kinds of dressing again the internet is your friend <laughs> i'm going to check on my pasta it's not been 10 minutes, but I just want to make sure it's not sticking. The reason you put in the oil is to make sure the salad, the pasta doesn't stick together like ugali. You know there's pasta that you can make pasta and then it's sticking together, it's clumpy, it's just nasty. Okay, so this is just enough time actually. Yeah, cut up everything is the same size okay so this looks almost ready Woo! Hot, hot, hot. 
So you take a piece out, like so. You see him? <laughs> take a piece out like that and press it between it, it coming apart very nicely. So that's ready. The pasta is good and ready. So you want to strain it in a colander over the sink for all the water out. Run cold water over it like so. So that it doesn't stick together. Alright, here we go. So first and foremost you want to put your pasta in a bowl and then add all your ingredients. So I have my My, tom my sweet corn, <laughs> my tomato, cucumber, lettuce is last, and tuna. Okay, so just mix that all around. Then you mix in your lettuce. I'm going to add some apple cider vinegar, just a touch, like maybe a tablespoon and a half. And I'll add some olive oil as well, just for seasoning. Again, a tablespoon and a half. We still want to add salt because even though we added salt to the pasta, we didn't add any to the vegetables. And we add pepper. This is an actual pepper corn. Okay. So pepper. You can eat this you can eat this now by the way you don't have to add the mayonnaise at this point it's just a nice treat to add okay so add mayo and that's it <clears throat> that's the salad Serve up your salad and enjoy.